a new vlog we're gonna get organized a little bit i'm so excited for like autumn winter i know it's a bit early but yeah i just wanted to go through my things um it was a little bit chilly this morning which got me really really excited so yeah i wanted to go through my things and maybe see what i have what i don't want anymore what i can donate or what i want to sell i love doing like my yoga sales and i'm so excited to be working with them i've worked with them so many times in the past and yeah i like to you know pass on good quality gently worn things to you ladies and yeah it's almost like giving a piece of my wardrobe to you and then i can make space for new things and buy more things i'm so excited so yeah we're gonna get a little bit organized today it's also the first time that I am sorting out and like doing my summer to winter wardrobe switch in this house. So yeah, I'm still figuring out everything. I'm still figuring out my system. <laughs> but even though we have way, way, way more space, I still like to have relevant pieces of clothing in my wardrobe. So I don't want to be seeing summer dresses when we're in like the middle of winter wearing coats and jackets and like cozy things so yeah hopefully this inspires you to maybe do the same i highly 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 recommend it so yeah i'm gonna go through everything i want to start with what i currently have in my cupboards right now so just a little overview of the wardrobes this is brain side that is my side brain's other clothing so it is around the corner and then this is all for me so i think i'm going to start with my pants which i keep in here i have literally like all of my pants in here and it's all kind of looking a little bit like disheveled and messy so i want to organize this and i take everything out see what i have try things on and then we can move to the next part is nice and empty I can wipe it out it gets pretty dusty maybe it's our chance okay so this is what we have so far I think I'm gonna like move things around as I organize the rest of the wardrobe but I have like all of my jeans I have all of my black pants and then besides the one white pair of jeans I have on I have another one and then like a creamy pair at the top which I don't really wear that often but it's easy to reach and then I did this a really cute little setup I'm just trying to figure it out still and then I just have some perfumes I decided to grab some of the perfumes from my collection that are more like autumn inspired like autumn winter like a little bit more of a warmer scent um so yeah i love the joe malone Marin Tonka. this is giorgio armani c which is like a perfume whale and then i really love the versace crystal Noir for like the winter time and they all like the bottles <laughs> really match nicely together and then i don't know what i'm gonna put at the bottom here and by the way the hair has gone up because this is a workout okay i think next i'm gonna do these drawers so i have two sets of drawers i have two like deeper ones and then just three or four things i reach for all the time like underwear i have some bikinis in here i have some scarves like smaller items so i'm gonna take all of these out and then make sure that i wipe and vacuum because things can get like a little bit dusty and stuff so just want to make sure that everything is nice and clean before I put it back you showed me how to reach for the best of myself it's all So I have 
all of my sports bras i decided to put my longer since it's going to be winter and i'm going to be wearing boots and layering and everything i decided to put my like longer socks and fold them this way and then i have gloves and some lingerie that aren't like you know my typical neutral i don't know i just i like white a skin tone and then like dark underwear i'm not like the biggest fan of wearing these kind of things every day so these are more like you know a treat <laughs> i'm not gonna elaborate um any more on that and then the bottom one is the bikinis which i can now use this drawer for something else i'm literally gonna pick maybe two bikinis to keep out because we have a pool and sometimes you, you never know so i'm gonna pack most of this away Just roughly just put all of my swimsuits in here and make sure that they're all nice and flat so not, none of the wires are getting bent but it doesn't have to be perfect. Um, I just put them in there and I really like these bags especially for like a seasonal wardrobe change because you can close them up and suction all of the air out and it just saves so much space and then you can take them out the next season and enjoy them again. started raining out of nowhere and all of that organizing was making me work up and up the tide quite a bit and I'm craving something warm so I'm thinking we have some left in the chicken I think I'm gonna chop that up and make like a chicken and mayo pizza bread I think that sounds really good oh, yeah. I tried so hard stumbling in the dark So I went ahead and grabbed my winter stuff, which we can go through in just a bit. I want to do this section next. So in here I have all of my like shirts and like jackets, but sometimes it gets a little bit messy. I've realized <laughs> right now I want to sort out the section of the wardrobe. So my tops. And like my blazers and jackets i just want to go through all of these things first it's all good when you show the way yeah I... things are starting to look so nice so i have this tall cupboard with a little bit of a space at the top i actually don't have anything up there at the moment so we might be able to find a spot for something up there but yeah in here i mainly just have like dresses i have my robe like longer things so i want to switch my like summer dresses out for like my longer coats and jackets and yeah just a few bulkier items over here i want to keep like I said, the coats and jackets, but I also want to keep them kind of at the top there. So I feel like I should go through this first and just empty it out before <laughs> I can go through all of the winter stuff. So this skirt, it's like a satin skirt. I've never worn this before, but I feel like something like this could be cute for the winter time with boots and like a chunky sweater. I don't know. I'm holding on to that look <laughs> and then this is like a dress i've worn it a few times in the summertime but it's just so hot so i think i might be able to wear this during like autumn at least with some boots and like tights i don't know we'll see um then i think i want to pack away this um 
dressing gown robe kind of thing it's more like summer vibes i think so i'm gonna pack that away okay let me just go through this i am so excited to wear like sweater dresses again i have this beige one and then i have a black one oh everything like over here and these are the things that i'm gonna sell on my yoga i'm so excited and while we are taking a little bit of a break from organizing in this room because we are going to be having a lot going on in this room today. We are finally getting curtains. Oh my goodness. It's been, we've been living here for two months. And about a month ago, we started planning and like picking out the fabric and everything. And today is the day. I'm so excited. Let yourself on You're so much deeper when you quit pain charades. Yeah. This is so special. This used to be my mom's basket. Like all of the brackets are in there. It's so cute. There's something sweet about your eyes when you feel safe. Yeah. You keep running away. Oh, it to yourself today. Just try to open up and show someone you care. You might not be intentional, but you beat your time. like designer bags in here um and we still don't have handles on these cupboards but we're gonna sort that out we're gonna go through like some of the bags that i packed and uh, make some space for my boots Let yourself there's something juvenile about your pretty face but it seems so hard for you to know when you need space I hope you find your peace and that you get a taste with yourself. Oh, yeah. Let yourself unfold. Just look how stunning <laughs> it looks. The house is really coming together nicely because of this one. She's got the vision. Open up, just spread your wings and jump to rise, not fall. You're flying higher. You jump to fly. Higher, higher. Open up, just spread your wings and jump to rise, not fall. You're flying higher. You jump to fly. Higher, higher. Okay, so Leafy said he really wants some lemon trees yeah. so we're gonna get two of these wall i really wanted to keep it simple and have it be like the feature in itself 
but I felt like this corner needed something and just a bit more like greenery and I wanted a specific plant or like a specific tree I wanted an olive tree but apparently they don't thrive indoors and I don't want a fake one I want a real tree a real plant so I got this one I don't know what the name is but we went to a lifestyle and I still have to get a pot for it but I'm so excited and I'm also so excited the fact that we literally sold out again in minutes on Yaga and I just wanted to say thank you so so much if you have no idea what Yaga is or if, or if you've never heard of it before, it's basically an app where you can buy and sell your pre-loved items. It's very safe, highly recommended. I've done a couple of sales before. So basically when you purchase an item, the buyer pays for the delivery. There's like a few options you can choose from. So it's not like a cost that the seller um, takes on their hand. You pay for the, the career fee and then once you buy an item yaga keeps the funds and only once i've sent the item and you've received it then i receive payment from yaga and anyone can open an account buy and sell like literally anything they have like clothing accessories home things uh, makeup i'm definitely looking at doing maybe like a makeup sale very soon so definitely go to my shop and follow me put your notifications on and i will definitely update you on instagram but yeah, there's nothing available on my yoga anymore because of you. You literally like just grab everything. And I just wanted to say how amazing you are. And another thing that I got a lot of engagement on was this carpet. So we have a new carpet in the living room, but it's not going to stay here. And before anyone asks, I have mentioned this before, the couches are from Shoon. I will link it down below. It's a proudly South African company. And it's just so nice to support people that are local. But yeah, this carpet is gonna move to the bedroom once I found the one that I really really want um but yeah I actually fished this out at Chinatown at Hill Fox it wasn't I would it was a pretty good price but I wouldn't say it was like day cheap some of those carpets were crazy priced but anyways uh that's where I got it from and I also got curtains finally and I wanted to walk you through and show you a little bit so this is the living room i really wanted this like wave kind of go as high as you can to the ceiling so even if you completely pull this open that wave feature still stays so the color it actually looks like a creamy white but it is actually just like a normal white i held a couple of samples against the wall to see which and it has this beautiful texture to it so we have them all over the house literally every single window and in the bedroom we have like the same curtain but it has this like beigey oatmeal color on the sides and yeah so that we can have a good night's rest has the same texture but it's obviously like that beigey creamy oh i just love this color brain's office is exactly the same white curtain but he has you can hear him typing <laughs> he has um a little blind that you can adjust just for a bit more privacy i'm actually getting these made for the kitchen as well and i'm just so excited for that to come i think um my brother's gonna come next week i think that's what he said so yeah a little bit of a family promotion in this vlog but it just it makes me so emotional to think that my brother's continuing my mom's legacy if you didn't know my mom used to be an interior decorator this is what she did for a living she made homes beautiful and the fact that he kind of she was she wasn't able to do this for me so the fact that he could do it for me and just it feels like she was here as he was doing it and it was just so special and it makes me so happy to see that my family has like perfectionist hands 
like I do like I can literally not find a fault everything is perfect and I know this is kind of like a biased review of my family services because it's family but I highly recommend him and I can't wait for the blinds in the kitchen so if you've been looking at like curtains or blinds I will leave his number in the description box and let him know that um, I sent you I think he would absolutely love that just be patient with him I had to be very patient with him um, because obviously they're a small team and you have to like wait for the material to arrive and the rods and like orders for that and then I think he takes like two to three weeks but perfection takes time I know this I have been around the block with this renovation and the moment you just sit on the couch and you look at your beautiful curtains it's like worth it and oh I'm just so happy. I feel like the house is really coming together. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog, ladies. I will hopefully see you in the next one. I hope so. And until then, bye, ladies. Breathe in some love.